Hey folks, how you doing? It's day 25 of the Tutoring Tips and Tricks series, season 3. My name is Deepak Shukla and today I want to talk about the importance of having a student toolkit. So, remember we talked before about um, having some fun facts and having some interesting things to reference to. Wind and bind that all up into a toolkit of really cool, fun, interesting stuff for your subject that your student basically will love. It's a great resource hub to pull interesting things out of the bag in those moments where you're a little bit low on inspiration, the energy's low, you need to switch things up and you need to do something perhaps a little bit left field. So you know if it's for example the area of psychology then maybe the film Good Will Hunting or a certain quote from the movie is something that will be appropriate in a certain situation. If it's um, if you're looking at you know I don't know if you're looking at mathematics then Go and have a look at something about Eastern philosophers and their involvement in math and, you know, all of those left field kind of things. Um, so have a toolkit. Get it from disparate places. The emphasis here is not rather on in, intimately useful, quote unquote, tools, but rather stuff that's moderately useful but highly interesting because this is the stuff that's really great as pick-me-ups and boosts that you'll need in those moments where the energy levels are a little bit low. So prepare your student toolkit, it can be a couple of page Google Docs documents with links to all over the internet or you can copy paste stuff in and put it into one document and that will be what you can use when things are a little bit low with your student. Thanks everybody.